Hi everyone, it's Hayden here with Town & Country Marine coming at you today with an all new model for 2025. This is the Bayliner D22i. Let's check it out. Bayliner's new D22i is Bayliner's largest model in their deck boat segment coming in just under 22 feet, eight and a half foot wide with enough room for up to 11 passengers. Now, who's this boat for? This boat is for people who wanna maximize their on-water experience with guests, with gear, and anything else you wanna bring on the water. It's a huge boat, it's extremely deep, so you're very versatile in the, in the size of water you can go in. You can go on the Great Lakes, you can go on small lakes. It's small enough to trailer, but big enough to take the big waves. So this boat classifies as a deck boat. And what is a deck boat? Typically deck boats have a much wider bow with much more seating. And you're gonna see a lot of other deck boats on the market gonna have their bow wall is gonna come out very aggressively and it's gonna create a big flat spot near your angle of entry. What that does is gonna create a large, almost smacking area for the boat as it crashes through the water. Bayliner's done a great job here at creating a nice steep angle of entry with a progressive V coming up to the side walls of the boat for a nice smooth, on water cutting experience. Now I want you to imagine this boat going through the water. You see we have an extremely steep dead rise going all the way up the front of the boat. Now just imagine crashing through the waves on this boat. You're not gonna have as much bouncing. You're not gonna have as much smacking and it's gonna allow you to cut through those waves with ease. Now a really great feature that Bayliner carried forward from the previous model is this beautiful transom area. We have this awesome seating at the back here with this beautiful aft facing lounger. It has an adjustable backrest. We also have an integrated swim platform with a nice soft grip mat so you can gather and congregate at the back of the boat with lots of space. You can even option for an additional extended swim platform for even more space at the back. We also have some great options at the back of the boat. We have a freshwater shower on the port side of the boat and we have underwater lights that you can turn on at the flick of a switch. Just enjoying this awesome transom seating we have on the D22i from Bayliner. This awesome Huge seating area back here is more than enough to fit three adults. It even has a hinging backrest here so we can maximize our cockpit space on the inside of the boat. And I also just wanted to touch on the huge storage compartment that we have under the seat right here. I'm a big guy, I'm over six foot tall. That's a lot of room for your gear when you're on the water. Another great feature on this new deck boat is the tiered transom walkthrough. The great thing about this tiered walkthrough is the rear swim platform is actually in line with most docks and decks and it allows you for easy access into the boat using these three steps to, for maximize accessibility for every family member. So as we saw, it's really easy to get in and out of this boat. When we're in the boat, we have this beautiful cockpit seating. We have an L group seating pattern, which is nice. We have optional seating that can extend up the entire side and across this rear facing seat here as well. We even have a table that's gonna integrate right into our cockpit for putting out lunch, drinks, and snacks. So with this cockpit seating, as you can see, I've got a really nice rear facing lounger on the passenger side of the boat, but due to this hinging backrest here on the passenger side, I can also sit here, here, or here in the front facing position. Additionally, a fan favorite feature on this new deck boat is this little sink area right here. We've got a freshwater sink that runs on the freshwater pump reservoir that we have on board the boat here, have a little counter preparation area and some additional storage underneath here. We've even got this great head compartment, which you can use as storage, or you can put a porta potty in there for long days on the water. So we love our storage on this boat. You can see we have a massive ski locker with tons of storage, really utilizing the extra depth that we get on this boat for all of your wet gear can go under the deck of the boat. An additional feature that I love about this deck boat is it has a self bailing cockpit. Any water that's gonna enter into the cockpit of the boat, make its way down onto the floor, is gonna go through our two drain holes that we have at the back of the cockpit here, and it's gonna freely flow out the side of the boat without entering your bilge. The advantage of that is your bilge pump is gonna have to pump out unnecessary water, so it's gonna preserve your battery life when you're not on board the boat. Now, one of my personal favorite features on this boat is the wake tower. Love to have a wake tower on a boat. It allows you to do wake sports. You can do wakeboarding, wake skating, whatever you want behind the boat. It also provides additional stability as you're entering the boat from either side. You can grab onto it. It's rock solid construction. It's really great for when you're crashing for, through the waves, you're not gonna get any rattling. Additionally, your integrated bimini is gonna be rock solid instead of rattling around through rough water when you're out on the lake. We also have a beautiful, comfortable helm seat on this boat with really nice appointments on the dash. We've actually optioned this boat with the Simrad glass dash display, which is gonna give you all your lake maps and your engine data right on this touchscreen display, right on the helm here. Adjacent to the touchscreen display, we have an upgraded Rockford Fosgate stereo system for pumping tunes on the lake with your friends. We also have lots of leg room underneath the dash. I'm over six foot, tons of room here to get comfortable. And additionally, we have a flip up bolster 
for crashing through the waves and getting above the windshield. So last but not least, one of the best highlights on this new deck boat is this enormous bow seating area. I have lots of room. We have beautiful L-wrapped upholstery around the back, so my back's nice and comfortable as I lean back. We could easily fit three adults on here. We've optioned this particular boat with the bow filler cushion, so we can use this as a bed up here for sun tanning and enjoying our time on the water. Additionally, you can get the optional bow wind block here as well to completely enclose this bow compartment for maximized comfort on the water. We even have upholstered backrest for when you're facing aft on the boat, even more comfort up here in the bow. Another main highlight on this deck boat, we have this beautiful bow ladder here for pulling up to the sandbar. You can easily deploy this in an instant for maximized accessibility when you're out at the sandbar on the boat. So as we've seen, this is a huge boat. We're gonna need a lot of power. So you're probably wondering what we're using for power in this boat. That's why we brought this in with the upgraded Mercury 4.5 liter stern drive engine. This is 250 horsepower. This is a great engine for Mercruiser. We've got the first marinized inboard engine on the market equipped in this boat. Thanks for watching our video on the all new Bayliner D22i deck boat. We look forward to seeing you on the water.